Well, hello. My name is Didier Mandelbrot. I'm the medical director of kidney and pancreas transplantation here at the University of Wisconsin. Um, the University of Wisconsin really has um, a variety of excellent training opportunities for fellows. Um, both the general nephrology fellows and the transplant fellow um, are able to participate in the activities of one of the very busiest programs in the country. Um, we perform over 250 kidney transplants every year and approximately 50 pancreas transplants every year. And in addition to being a very high volume center, there are a number of uh, really cutting edge programs that the fellows are able to participate in. Um, these include uh, desensitization programs to allow uh, transplantation between donors and recipients that are incompatible uh, in terms of their ABO group or their HLA typing. There are also uh, cutting edge programs in terms of the diagnosis and treatment of antibody mediated rejection. Um, and we also have some very cutting edge programs in terms of live donor paired exchanges. In addition to these opportunities for kidney transplantation and pancreas transplantation, the fellows are able to be exposed to uh, recipients of liver transplants as well as heart transplants and lung transplants. And we're able to do that because we provide nephrological consult care to these recipients of other organs. So there's really a, a very wide variety of clinical opportunities for the fellows. And in addition, there are a great number of educational opportunities for the fellows, so specifically didactic sessions for the fellows. Um, these include a seminar series on the basics of transplantation. There's uh, also regular journal clubs um, and the regular transplant grand rounds. Um, and in addition, all the faculty in transplantation are really dedicated to the education of the fellows and to mentoring the fellows as they progress in their career. And finally, uh, there are really outstanding research opportunities for the fellows that train here. Um, there are a number of basic science labs um, that provide opportunities to study basic transplant immunology. And in addition, there is a truly exceptional clinical database um, this has data on over 5,000 former kidney transplant patients, and we've been able to mine it for, to answer all sorts of clinical questions um, that may apply to specific rare subsets of patients and really allow us to answer questions that very few programs in the country are able to address. Um, so overall, I think the fellows really have outstanding opportunities for training in transplant medicine um, at really one of the premier programs in the country.